congratulations, Purple Carpet for the Tiger's Apprentice. I mean, I mean, it is it is beautiful. How does it feel for being here today? It feels great. Um, you know, it's a it's a winter day. It's a little little toastier than usual. Um, it's really cool to be here to celebrate this awesome project that we've been working on for the past half a decade. It feels like so to see all of it, you know, come to fruition. To actually meet a lot of the cast and crew in person for the first time. Um, it all it all feels like it's finally real. It's it's such a such a blessing. I feel like we're celebrating. I know it, it is kind of funny to work in a like a voice voiceover booth by yourself, and then meeting other people and other characters for the, or seeing the character other characters for the first time possibly today. Yeah, um, yeah. We've been doing so much of it like in isolation from each other. So now it's like. Um, it's cool to actually like put a face and body to like the voices that I've been hearing. Now tell us about how important like these type of stories should be actually told, whether it's on the small screen or on the big screen. Mm. I mean, there's so many parts of this story that are just so like so authentic and so true to just the Asian American experience, and I think that's really important to have representation of that on the screens. You know, anyone that grew up like myself or grew up like these characters can can kind of relate to that and feel seen. Um, and also, aside from it being a really Asian American cultural story. I think it's cool to see Asian characters in universal stories and universal themes to show that it's like, okay, we don't just do the martial arts, we don't just do the stuff that you would think of an Asian story, but we're also like a very rich and deeply human story as well. So it's, it's relatable no matter what background you're from. Last question What's your zodiac sign and do you relate to it? Um, I'm a pig, and yes, um, pigs are. We're loyal, apparently. Um, we we're very prosperous and fortunate, and we are we're indulgent. So we like food, and we like taking care of ourselves, and we like we like the nice things in life. So I think those boxes all check off. Yeah, I feel like a pig. I I love being Asian. We love food too. We always love food, no matter what culture. Oh man, food is love. Food is identity. It's culture. So yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you.